guys, it's Jennifer and welcome back to Busy Being Jen. I am here today for an empties video for the month of September. Cannot believe that September is gone already. I had a huge empties video last month that was actually a few months worth of empties. So I don't have a lot this month, but I do have enough things to share in a video, but this will be pretty quick. So let me go ahead and get started. This container is kind of a mess because I have been keeping it in my shower. This is Jurgens Natural Glow um, Medium to Tan Skin Tones. Gradually creates flawless natural looking color. Now I do not have medium to tan skin. My skin is pretty light, but I always feel like they're light to medium. Um, self tanner is just it just doesn't do much and so i feel like this i get more bang for my buck if i go with the darker one so it's kind of nice it's not one of those self tanners that immediately just colors your skin right away you really have to use it a few times before you start to notice the difference and what i do is i leave this in my shower through the summer and then every time I, you know, when I dry off in the shower, then I, I remember to put this on. It does a really nice job of moisturizing the skin. This particular one is a firming, skin firming formula. They have one that's, you know, not, that's just regular lotion. But anyway, so I just um, pat my skin dry and then put this on. And, you know, after a few times of using it, I start to notice that my skin is looking a little bit less white than it was before. I have another one of these that I'm currently using and I will keep using this product. So yeah, it's a great one. Okay, next. Next, I have a concealer. It's Bye Bye Under Eye by It Cosmetics. This was fine. I, I don't know that I thought it was amazing. Um, I don't know. I hear people talking about it and saying how much they love it. Maybe there's a trick to using it that makes it better, but I didn't really think of it as being anything like better than the Maybelline Instant Age Rewind that I typically use. This one says it is, let's see, um, full coverage, anti-aging, waterproof concealer. Yeah, Bye Bye Under Eye. So it was, you know, it was good. Does it say what shade it is that I use? Medium. Oh, light medium yeah so um it was good it was fine but um yeah will i buy it again probably not <laughs> so okay and the next thing i have here is um, my go-to my current go through mascara i have had a few in the past that i have loved with all my heart and then they discontinue them um so this one is by stila it's called huge extreme lash this is very nice very nice. I have another one of these that I'm using, so definitely like it, and I think it's good, but I used to use Cargo, Cargo's uh, Boundless Lashes that I really loved, and before that, I was using Julep's, um, what was it called? Uh, big Lash or Big, I don't know what it was, but I loved that one, and they discontinued both of them, so I guess what I'm going to ask you guys here is, what is your favorite mascara? What I'm looking for is something that lengthens and also thickens, like adds volume. So yeah, what do you use? Please comment and help me. Help me, please. <laughs> okay. Um, okay, and then the next three things are skincare items. So this one is, uh, I love this. This is um, by, uh, it's by Hada Labo, Tokyo. It is skin plumping gel cream and it's, it is definitely a gel. And I think I've talked about this. I might've talked about it in my last empties video, but this has hyaluronic acid in it. It does help draw moisture into your skin. So you splash water on your face and you do not even pat your face dry. You want your face to be dripping wet. I only take a towel and just kind of pat my eyes. So water's not dripping into my eyes. Take some, a good amount of this and put it all over my face and my neck and my chest, sometimes even on the backs of my hands. And then you just go get a cup of coffee. Just, you want it to absorb, take all that water that's on your skin and you want it to suck it right into your skin cells. And so 
Um, I use this every single morning. I love this stuff. It's great. I highly recommend it. I actually have it on Amazon's subscribe and save, so it automatically gets sent to me every two months. Yeah, I love it. And it's really reasonably priced. The next one is by Glim Glimmer Goddess. It is Organic Pumpkin Alpha Hydroxy Face Mask. And this I use once a week. Now, this is the real deal, you guys. You put this on your face and within seconds, it just starts stinging your skin. Like, I didn't know the first time I used it if I was going to be able to handle it. Um, so you wash your face and then you just take a brush and kind of brush this on. I put it on all over. I do not put it around the eye area. I don't put it under my eyes. I do not put it above my eyes. Completely avoid that area. And then, um, and then I don't put it around like the corners of my mouth and nose because those can be kind of sensitive areas too. But I put it all over my face and my neck. And then you let it stay on. This says to put it on, to leave it on for, how long does it say? 15 to 20 minutes. I have only been leaving it on for probably 10 to 15. When I first started, I 10 minutes tops. And then, um, you know, after I had gone further and further through this jar, I was leaving it on longer. The uncomfortable part, the, the itchy, it's not, it's kind of a sting, but it's mostly an itch, like a really deep, annoying itch. Like all you want to do is just scratch. And that only lasts about five minutes. So if you can get through the first five minutes, then leaving it on for 15 or 20 is not going to be difficult at all. But what it does, it's just another one of those acids that removes some of the um, dead skin layers that we have and so that when we put on serums and different things that they can actually get to the part of your skin that it can do good work on. And so if you have, you know, lots of layers of dead skin cells, you put serums on top and there's just too far for those serums to go in order to, to do a good job. So I only use this once a week. Um, let me just say, if you get it, just be prepared and just know that you're, it's not going to feel that way for the entire amount of time that you leave it on your skin. Now, I have another jar of this, you know, because I've used this up. The one, this one is pumpkin alpha hydroxy face mask. The other one that I have is not pumpkin. It's just whatever the regular thing is. And so, yeah, if you're looking for something that is going to get rid of some of those layers of dead skin cells, give it a try. And um, I'm, I'm linking all these things in the space below. I got this on Amazon. It was pretty reasonably priced. Two more things. Okay, so this is um, by Fifth and Glow. It's called Unbuttoned Beauty. And what it is, is a neck and chest cream. It is specifically made for the skin on your neck and chest because you know how um if you look at people their their face will age differently from the neck and chest it even um seems to like the color of the skin on your face from your skin and neck can be different so it really is just it's got a different makeup and tends to be much more sensitive so i saw a video about this um not, I mean, from the company and I was intrigued by it. They had a thing where like, um, you could buy this container for so much money, but if you buy 10 of them, then you get it for cheaper. And I was like, no, no, I just want to try one. And then, so as I'm going through the checkout process, they said, well, but you know, if you get two, it's only $5 more. So I thought, okay, well, that's actually a really good deal. And then because I bought that one, then they said you can get a third one for free. So yeah, so I ended up with three of these. So I'm on my second one now. But, um, you know, have I noticed like a huge change in my neck and my chest? No, but it feels good. And I'm willing to continue to give it a shot and kind of see if, um, you know, if there's a difference over time. And then the last thing is my go-to Holy Grail moisturizer that I use. It used to be called Hydro Lift. It is now called Matanika. 
It is by a company called Lavier Labs. I've done some review videos on this. In fact, I'm going to link one of them for you right here that shows before and after pictures after I had been using this product for a year. It's pretty amazing. You can actually see a dramatic difference. Well, I mean, as dramatic as as can be expected from using a moisturizer it's a pretty it's a pretty noticeable difference one year later um i love this stuff i you know i use this other product on my neck and my chest but i use this on you know my my whole face and um a little on my eye area i kind of put it everywhere else first and the leftover on my hands i put on my eyes but it actually has changed the texture of my skin the wrinkles on my skin it really has changed and I love this and I will continue to use it. So that is it for my empties for the month of September. I hope you liked this video. Again, I've linked all of those things in the space below. Well, some have links, but I've listed them in the space below for you. Um, if you're not a uh, subscriber to Busy Being Jen, I would love to have you come along with me. I hope I'll see you again on Busy Being Jen. Take care, you guys. Bye-bye.